Comparing to the Porsche 356, the Porsche 911 was, technically speaking, a quantum leap. The new air-cooled six-cylinder boxer engine in the rear of the new Porsche 911 has a higher smoothness than the four-cylinder boxer engine at the 356 model. The performance of the 2-liter engine was originally 130 horsepower at 6100 rpm. The fuel mixture is treated in two triple downdraft carburetors. A mechanical injection double road pump is preparing the 2.7 liter engine of the Porsche 911 Carrera RS 2.7 to the mixture. This allows a maximum of 210 horsepower. This racing car should not be reserved to come on the road as a touring car. To receive the sports homologation, Porsche had to build at least 500 models with roadworthiness of the special 911 RS models. 1972, Porsche introduced therefore the Porsche 911 Carrera RS with a 2.7 liter engine at the Paris Motor Show. One in every detail slimmed down, lightweighted racing car. At first Porsche feared that the model would not sell because of the oil crisis. But the opposite happened and Porsche presented another 500 vehicles. To reduce the weight, thinner metal was used for the body. A thin lightweight glass from Belgium for the windscreen, rear and side windows, re-announcement were made on the insulation material, a sunshade on the passenger side and on the dashboard clock. With a 210 horsepower strong 2.7 liter Carrera 6 cylinder boxer engine, the RS reached a top speed of 240 km an hour. The performance can be seen, but even more clearly in the acceleration. The Porsche 911 RS moves from 0 to 100 in 5.8 seconds. Only 500 units were built of the 2.7 RS models. For experts, it's one of the best sports cars in the 70s and desirous in every Porsche collection.